M0FXP, welcome to my channel. So if you've got an RTL SDR dongle, hopefully you've got an original one. I've been watching TechMind's video and he's downloaded a plugin for ISM Packet Decoder. So it picks up uh, the sort of data packet packets from things like, I don't know, your, your key fob or your tire pressure sensor, or weather stations, and so much more. So I thought I'd have a go at downloading this. So I've gone to the link here from GitHub. So here's the link, which will be in the description. Click the green code here. Go down to download zip like so. Once you've got your zip, ex click it and then extract it. Ignore the message. Extract to and put it somewhere you're going to find it. And I put mine in a file called RTTTT. So, and then you click OK. But I'm not going to do it in this case because we've already done it. So you'll have that. Now, this is assuming you've already got SDR Play downloaded. If you haven't, just go here and go Software Defined Radio Package. And download here there's a separate video which I'll put a link in the description of how to to run this so once you've done that click out this is what they look like the uh, the dongles look quite smart really um, well inside that is anyway stop waffling so back to SDR let's go back to the file that we've just created so files look for the the one that's you put in which mine was RTTL and uh, so we're here like so click it then double click this one here then uh, double click install and then go down to DNL and double click and look you've got the three files that you're gonna have to copy and paste here to copy just do that so click left click so it all goes blue then copy click copy mine is here so copy so I've got them copied now now go back to your SDR actual file uh, which you should have somewhere stored and see the way it says plugins here right click and go new folder and name it as he as um, tech minds did D I think L don't think it's super important what you name it 433 so you can find it then double click it then uh, right click and paste those files yeah paste there you go they are they're pasted into that file now so now you go back to SDR Sharp, you've got all the files. Now what I did, I had to drag it down like that into plugins uh, to make it work. Okay, now I've already done that, so we're not going to do it twice. So now when you fire up um, SDR Play, so back to your file again. Um, if you can, right click Run Administrator, but double click SDR Sharp, should I say, not Play. You get this window and then set the frequency. I set it as a 432920. I set it at because that's what TechMinds did. Then click play. Okay, now you need an antenna connected, you need your dongle plugged in. And now when you go to plugins, it will be here. See it at the bottom RTL433. So start that. Now I don't think I haven't really used this. So now what you can now select is list messages and you enable it then list messages if you go a bit wider here see my arrows here just pull that across and then click start when you click start now I keep getting an error tell me why yeah you get if you click down here on the bottom spacebar you get a new window and that's where all your decoded packet or messages will show up so Show me why, why mine's blank, but I think this video will show you how to install it. Thanks for watching my channel, 7-3, all the best.